I'm Rosalie. I'm a mom of eight kids and I'm in the Costco shop. Uh, I'm in the Costco parking lot right now because uh, someone was really nice. A lovely lady was nice enough to gift us a Costco membership. So this is going to be our Costco haul today. And I like to say thank you very much. And that was really sweet. And that was very special of her. So thank you very much. We're going to go in and get our membership and then do some shopping. And I'll take you along with. Okay. See you in a minute. I wonder if these ever go on sale. $3.33 per container of floss. Yes, yes, floss, yes. floss. Exciting, eh? Yeah. Floss. I want to brush my teeth and brush my teeth. Oh, well, that's good. You want to brush your teeth and floss your teeth? Yeah, you like those little containers? I need to cut his hair. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah, Dad. Yeah. I only, yeah, I only cut his bangs a few weeks ago, and I didn't have time to do the back, and now it's grown even more. I definitely need to cut it. Mommy, yeah. You can't floss now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Excited little boy. Right. Let's move on here. Soap. Wow. Soap. You yeah, have soap. Wow. Yeah. Pretty good stuff, eh? Pretty exciting stuff. All of the containers here. Yeah. Whoops. It's hard to steer here with one hand. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at all this stuff, eh? Yeah, pretty exciting. I just turned around the corner and look at what they have. It is getting harder to find these boxes of salt. Walmart only sells them in bags right now. Good mommy. Sorry. Good mommy. And that's actually a really good price for salt. Like less than a dollar a box. That's pretty good. That's what you pay for from Walmart and you get it in a bag and it sucks because you can't really pour the salt out when you're cooking a larger batch. It just gets everywhere. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Actually, you know what? At this price, I'm going to get two because that seems too low. I am expecting that price to go up in a few months. That is really reasonable. So I'll get two of those. Yeah. I'm going to take a guess and I'm going to guess that'll go up probably 30 cents in the next few months. It's kind of fun to guess and see if you can predict prices yeah yeah salt salt another thing i just remembered we want chili powder let me see here where's the chili powder um hmm. i think i just passed it's got to be here somewhere Ah, oh, here we go. Chili powder. Oh, what? There it is. Six dollars. That's really good. You get a big container like this. Six bucks. I bought some chili powder, the Walmart brand, and it was darker in color. It was uh, brown looking. But I don't know if that affects the quality or not. Um, but... We go through a lot of chili powder. I make my own taco seasoning. So we'll get one of these. Yeah. Here's evaporated milk. I just had a haul. I just did a haul like a few days ago where I bought 
evaporated milk for a dollar a can. So here it's $10.99 and you only get six cans. So I would not consider that a good deal. If you like better than bouillon, which is healthier than just the bouillon I buy, this is a big whopping, what is it? It says two kilograms on it? No, yeah, no, where? Where did I see two kilograms? Oh, down there, wrong one, okay. If you like better than bouillon, this is a big whopping container of 597 grams. It looks like it's double the size of what you would get at the regular grocery store. And it's selling for $12.99. You know, if it goes on sale, I'll think I'll get some. But we go through, like, we would probably have to use a quarter of this container just for one of our meals, like a big batch of soup or something. But you get 100 servings in it. They also have it in beef and vegetable. This is a really good deal. If you want pure vanilla, you buy this. It's almost half a liter and it's $13.99. Well, these are all Canadian prices, but you get a little tiny container at the grocery store, pure vanilla extract for $7 and that's cheap. You can also go for the artificial vanilla here, $7.99, which is way cheaper. This you'll get just about a whole liter for $7.99. So that is a great deal. Yeast too, in my opinion, this is really great too. Yeast, you buy those little packets and you get three of them and they're like three something Canadian. This is 908 grams. You keep it in the freezer. If you don't, if you just want to use a little bit of it, put the rest in the freezer or you can keep your yeast in the fridge. It'll keep a lot longer. And I heard you can keep it in the freezer for like almost forever and it won't go bad. So that's a really good deal too. If you do bake your own bread, get your yeast here. Icing sugar seems to be a good price too. This is what I would pay on sale at Walmart. I can find this on sale probably, I don't know, two, maybe three times a year. They'll put it on sale for around $2 something. Here it's $2.29. And look at what I just found. I just said we make our own taco seasoning. And here is Clubhouse taco seasoning and it's only $5.49. So yes, please. Yes, exactly cheaper than making it. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Uh, I'd, I'd pay $5.49 for the convenience. That's great. Here's the Costco brand chocolate chips. $27.99 and you get two kilograms. I would not buy chocolate chips here at Costco because I know around Easter they put a lot of baking stuff on sale, the grocery stores that is. And I have bought the big containers of the brand Chip It's for about seven or eight dollars and I think they're 700 and something grams. This would be 2,000 grams, two kilograms. So 700 and something grams and I paid $8. So I would just keep my chocolate chips in the freezer and wait for it to go on a good sale. And you'd have to do that anyway if you buy a big bag like this. Mommy. Unless you make a lot of cookies. Mommy. He's got his pink shoes on. His Nike shoes broke and I have to fix them. Stop. What? Stop, little guy. Here's the flour. Big bag of sugar. Again, I don't think this is uh, as great a deal as some of the other items at Costco. Six twenty-nine. Now, again, if you need it right away, go ahead and buy it. But again, if you wait for the baking supplies to go on sale. Uh, you can get a smaller package and it'd be around two dollars. Okay guys, come on, get down. Okay. Okay, yes. Yeah. 
No, little guy, I don't want you to fall off there. Mom, Come on down. Mom, that's me. Yeah. I did it on my own. You did it all on your own. Wow. <laughs> she sat on the right, on the sugar, all on her own. Look at that. Okay, come on guys, let's get going. Next aisle. Come on. Gotta be careful with the shopping carts. It's almost like a game here, a frogger. These are nice. Eddie Bauer reversible jacket. $20. I don't need any jackets, but these are nice. Yes. Look at that. It's got all of this cozy kind of um, like a Sherpa inside. Yes. Yes. Just a moment, okay? We still need to get a few more things, all right? Then we can go to the checkouts, but there isn't, there isn't candy at the checkouts here. There's no candy at the checkouts. Come on, we got to go down this uh, congested aisle here. Come on, guys. Whoa. Here we have tomato sauce, Alfredo sauce, $18.99 for three of these jars. I'm waiting to see if they're going to have those cans of pasta sauce on sale again for a dollar at Walmart or no frills or somewhere. Okay, here we have tomatoes, whole peeled with basil. That seems like a lot. Because I can buy diced tomatoes and whole peeled tomatoes. <clears throat> Recently I just saw it at $1.25 a can at No Frills. <clears throat> so I don't know why they're charging this price. Organic tomato sauce. Yeah, I think if you're buying a lot of organic, this would be the place to get it because that can be really expensive at grocery stores. The minute rice is a good deal here. Three kilograms for $10.99. Aaron used to make a lot of minute rice, but now he's out of that phase. He prefers regular rice now because he thinks it's healthier. Hello, Empress. Okay, let me turn this around here. Craft dinner here is $13.49 for 12 boxes. In one of my hauls, I paid less than a dollar a box, so this is not a good deal. Wait for it to go on sale for less than a dollar a box and then stock up. Just need to turn around the corner here. Okay, mashed potatoes. Here they are. We love these mashed potatoes. They used to come in boxes. I wonder if they give you less now. Yeah. <laughs> wow, is that your throne? Yep. Wow. Wow. Okay, so we will be getting some of this $3 off. It's the time to buy it. I think I will get one. Mm -hmm. 
will splurge and we'll get three. It's only going to get more expensive. Today's the last day of the sale. So that is three. These are so cute. Organic cotton sleeper, $8.99. That's good for organic. If you're into organic cotton, this is a good deal, in my opinion. Oh, look at these cute sets here. $16.99. Oh my goodness, Gap? Since when is Gap available here? Two tops for $14.99. Really? Wow, that is great. I can't believe it. $7.50 a top from Gap. That is really cute. I also have these. So you get a polo shirt, regular shirt, and a button one. Those are cute. I like those colors. I like, I like the colors that don't stain so easy. You like that one, eh? Yeah. I don't believe these peckle ones are organic cotton. They're just regular cotton. Well, that's cute. Oh, it looks like you get two outfits here. That's nice. $16.99, two outfits. I don't think you can beat that much. It's very similar to Carter's. Three to 24 months. I didn't see any 24 months here because this little guy, he still fits 24 months in. Yeah, wow, balls. Hey, soccer balls. Ooh, cars. He likes the cars. I like the lemons. That's cute. You know, if you buy clothes with embroider on, embroidery on it, one thing I don't like is that this pad on the back, it always seems to come off when you wash it, and it only takes like two times before it comes off. This one's really nice too. Oh, look at those sweaters. Rococo, I never heard of the brand. But this is a little bit more, $19.99. Yeah, I really like the chunky cable knit sweater. That's really cute. Can we get it? No, the baby has. Okay. Here we are, Gusty. Gusty's a good brand. I used to have a few of these when my older boys were little. They're nice and warm. 
they're really good quality. See the hood even has like this elastic around it. So the wind doesn't blow into their hood so easy. There's girls. Really? $35? I think if you need a brand new snowsuit, this is the place to come. Hi. Yeah. Mommy. Oh, this is nice. Mommy. I like those colors together. Mommy. Yeah. Mommy. Um, um, I like that. Yeah. Mommy. Oh, this is cute. Mommy. Mommy. I just remembered that Passion outgrew a lot of her sweaters, so I don't think she has many sweaters that fit her now. So we probably need a medium for her. And I don't see any medium in the purple. Let me see here. Um, I don't know if they have any passion. There's large down there. I think they only have purple. I'll need two hands to look through this pile. Okay, we couldn't find the medium in the purple, so she chose blue instead. I wonder how much it's going to shrink, though. All right, I checked it against her body, and I think it'll still fit her even if it shrinks, so we'll get this one. It's just too bad they don't have the purple one. Yeah. We're going to go home soon. Yes, we're going to pick up a chicken here, okay? And we're going to have that today for supper, okay? All right, come on, let's go. I'm looking for our cart now. No, where's our cart? Where's our cart? Where did it go? Okay. We do oh, this is it. Okay, great. Found our cart. Moving on now. Looks like they got some bigger coats here. And hey, I didn't even see that. That's those are nice colors. Eddie Bauer. Okay. In my opinion, and where I live. Yes, little guy. What? You wanna sit there? Oh, okay. All right, let's go and get our chicken now. Rotis rotisserie chicken. Yeah. Here, you should sit down. Sit down, my guy. Yeah, we're gonna go and get our meal, and then I think we'll be done. Yeah. You know, I just passed this, and I think this is a really good price for a safe. I mean, I remember a safe like this size at Staples would go for about $400, or at least like 360 or something. Watermelon, six ninety nine. No thanks. I like to pay three hundred three dollars for ours, and ours is about that size too. Oh, well, they already got out the Halloween costumes. Now this is what I get excited for. You see these onions, $6.99 for 10 pounds. And they're the nice big onions. Usually when you buy 10 pounds of onions at the grocery store, you get like those little onions. And it's more trouble and work to peel and cut them than it is these big onions. So this is what I'm gonna get. Not the red onions at $8.99 for five pounds. 
and not the sweet onions for $6.99 and five pounds. But these ones over here, the 10 pounds for $6.99. Those are the ones I'm going to get. Okay, guys, you gotta sit down. Passion, are you tired? <laughs> okay, come on, we gotta find a spot in the cart here for this. All right, there we go. And I almost forgot we need some eggs. Yeah, eggs. Eggs. You want to get out? Okay. So I can make some room for you. Oh, well, isn't that nice? I wonder how much these carrots are. 10 pounds for $6.99. Now I know at No Frills right now, often they have the imperfect carrots, and I think that's about four or five pounds for four dollars. Ten pounds, that's actually a good price. This Rudolph's multigrain bread is good. But I just bought a whole bunch of these types of bread. Yes. Careful you don't trip on that pallet. Yeah, we have bananas at home. Oh, okay. So you get this big loaf here, 1.2 kilograms. One kilogram is 2.2 pounds. And it's only $4.99. So I think one of these loaves is about 500 grams usually at the grocery store. So you split that in half, it would be like less than $2.50 you're paying per loaf. So if you haven't stocked up on bread half off, here's a good place to get it. They also have sourdough and the ones with the sesame seeds on it. Hold on. Just trying to navigate through here. And chicken should be over here. That's really cheap. The rotisserie chicken we get from Zares is 700 grams and it's $15. So that's really cheap. You think one is enough, Julius? It looks small. So well, it's 1.2 kilograms. How much is the one we get? Actually, you know what? We're going to get two because then whatever's left over we'll use for chicken soup or something else because this really isn't a bad price that's probably similar to what you would pay for a chicken that you have to cook yourself okay chicken yep yeah, that's for supper tonight All right, um, let me see here. And we have some of those Hawaiian rolls at home. So I think, I think we can get away with using that as dinner rolls with the rotisserie chicken tonight. I just paid three dollars and I thought that was a really good deal for the pillars German salami at no frills and this is only going to be 280 283 I think per 150 grams instead of three dollars and definitely it's a whole lot more if you don't buy it on sale at the grocery store but I rarely see it on sale for three dollars anyway from no frills so next time I need more salami I'm going to get it here Dady's going to be happy. He loves pogos and look, they're on sale. $34.11.99. That is definitely way cheaper than the grocery stores in my area. So 
I am going to split it into batches of 10. I'll put some in the freezer downstairs. Yep. And I'll put 10 in the fridge upstairs, the fridge freezer, just so that they don't eat it all in like a few days. But that's a great price. Yeah. It's $15 at the grocery stores in Walmart in my area for $20. $15.99, you get $30, and it's on sale for $11.99. Okay, so here we are waiting in line, and that's going to be it for the Costco haul today. Okay, right now we are waiting in line to check out. And so for this Costco haul, we've got the Pogos, we've got the marble cheese slices for Julius, we got the three bags behind Passion of the mashed potatoes, we have the 10 pound bag of onions, we got her sweater of course, that stuffy she brought in with her, we got the eggs. The two, yes, what? You don't want me to push it? Okay, you can pull it. The two packages of salt. Julie's got some half and half cream. And just a minute, Passion, right behind your head here, we got the taco seasoning and chili powder right here. And our two rotisserie chickens. So I got to put it on the belt now. Total came to 127.83. And I'll just be putting this stuff in the back of our van. So thank you for watching and coming along with us shopping for this Costco haul. And as always, I'll see you again in the next video. Bye.